When working with a Raspberry Pi, you might want to create a custom image to store for later or to burn onto multiple SD cards for many Raspberry Pis. Unfortunately, in the past, this used to be very difficult, so I created a project, PyBaker, to solve this problem. So to get started, you'll want to go to my repository and install the dependencies listed in the README file. There's only two dependencies, Python 3 and Docker. Preferably Docker Desktop because it makes it easier to monitor what's going on. Next, you can go to the top right hand corner, click the code button and then download a zip file. Once this is downloaded, you can open it and extract the folder to a convenient location. Next, you can open up this folder in your favorite text editor. I'm going to use VS Code. It's also helpful to open up Docker Desktop to see what's going on. Next, you can type in python setup.py and it will create your image. And yes, it really is that easy. This may take a while as it's going to create a virtual Raspberry Pi emulator and set that up. You'll see files starting to appear in the dist folder. After a while, both of the containers should stop and you'll be left with a distro.img file. This file is bootable by a Raspberry Pi. Now, you probably don't want a stock Raspberry Pi image, so to fix that, we use Ansible. Ansible allows us to write a simple script that can customize our Raspberry Pi. This script is located in the Ansible playbooks main.yml. You can see that there's an example script and this script updates the Raspberry Pi and then copies files from the files folder into the Raspberry Pi home slash Pi directory. You can modify this to set up the Pi in any way you want. There is tons of documentation on how to use Ansible and it is very easy to get started. Once you are done writing your Ansible playbook, simply run setup.py again and wait for it to finish. Hopefully this video allowed you to create your own custom Raspberry Pi image and you can head over to my GitHub page if you want to contribute. Also, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and giving this video a like.